you know, go down to green grapes or something. They're less powerful till you can get the stomach cleaned up and the GI tract cleaned up, and then that won't happen to you. Uh, I'm suffering probably most of my life from anxiety and fear. That's your adrenal glands, honey. And then again, going right on top of the kidneys. You're going to be okay here now. I'm really tired of it. Can you tell me how to deal with it? We do have, you keep working on your adrenal glands. We do use uh, the, like the Bach flower remedies, but we use a lady that's very psychic at Fox Mountain. She has incredible uh, uh, flower essences for out of body experiences, for everything you want. A very spiritual lady, very powerful flower essences. Moonshine Yarrow is what we use here a lot. I used it in the ER. We actually used it in the Oklahoma bombing. I was working with a mental health clinic that was handling the Oklahoma bombing, and we used it on firemen, paramedics. I mean, it just it just really bring help. So use the flower essences for your emotional problems. We have some great flower essences here for that, and and, and that's what flowers are for. Um, any ideas how to conquer it? Yeah. Uh, my blood pressure is still low, 90 over 60. I know. You know, well, you could try some licorice root, see if that licorice root will definitely help with pain, too. And it definitely controls blood sugar, so licorice root off. Oh, you're not alive. You're plastic. <laughs> uh, I got some blackberries here that look real. I got them in the mountains. Tell me that doesn't look like a real blackberry. I've had a lot of kids try to eat them. I love real looking fruit, but um, let me see here. I'm also afraid to move on with my life because of this cyst. Would you quit it? These are just cysts on the ovaries. Don't freak out. Medical doctor, let them freak out. They don't know what to do with it anyway, but don't you freak out. You can move on with your life. You have fun. These are just little tumors that's going to come off of there because you know the keys and the secret to this, sweetheart. Don't trap yourself in this. You go live life and enjoy life. These tumors will come out. If you put attention on them, you're keeping them there. Let your attention go. Let it go. Yeah, let them go. Scared me that it can break. And so a lot of people, a lot of women pop their cysts. And yes, it's a little painful to pop a cyst. Okay. Keep going, sweetheart. Don't don't stop. There's nothing there to be scared about. Don't be scared about nothing. This is your lymph system, plain and simple. You got to fix your adrenals anyway, right? You got to fix your kidneys. You don't want deeper problems, so keep going. You'll be fine. Uh, is it stupid that I feel this way? Yeah, yeah. Don't feel this way. You have no basis for fear, sweetheart. You know, you just backed up lymphatically, and now you're going to fix it. And you're fixing it. You're fixing it, right? Don't know how to fight it. You're fighting it. You're working it, man. I'm on adrenal tincture and kidneys and lymphatic 4 and 2. Thank you, Paula. Sweetheart, 28 years old. Uh, uh, Paulina, you're doing it. Kick it. Go have fun. Release this and enjoy your life, honey. These are just little tumors come right out. No problem. Just keep yourself focused on your diet. Just be healthy and happy every moment and let everything go. Let all these acids and all these tumors and polyps and cysts, let them all go. We don't want them. You don't want them. And don't be scared. Let medical doctors be scared. Let them be very scared. <laughs> Let them get smart and aware. That's what I say. We got to get awareness going here, pumping in the AMA. We got to get this a big tube of awareness and start pumping it into that modality, so we quit this insanity of hurting people and keeping people in fear. Water retention. Uh, I am an athlete and I want to lose some fat so I can get to very low body fat percentage. So I can do my best in my sport, which is soccer. What is your take on calories for weight loss? I'm currently doing the grape cure. You know, you're doing the best thing you can do. Take that fat right out of there, man. Yeah, that's how you get rid of all fats, is the fruititarian lifestyle, absolutely. And talk about energy and stamina and the strength and the agility and the endurance to maintain a soccer uh, activity, absolutely. You'll get a certain point. If you push this, you'll get past a certain point, my friend. You'll have so much energy, your, your teammates will freak. You'll just have insane amount of endurance and energy. That's where you're going, and that's what an athlete needs. And uh, I'm telling you, you you get up some of these higher levels of health, and you're gonna whop butt. 
absolutely. Uh, should I watch my calories? No, I don't even think about calories at all, ever. This is about chemistry and magnetics. And you'll notice on a, uh, counting calories, if you're eating cooked food, and someone made this comment, you can eat and eat cooked food, but raw foods, you can only eat so much and you'll pull away. You're full of energy, you're full of nutrition, why would you need more? This idea of counting calories I thought was extremely stupid. You don't see any other animals do that. Uh, let me see. Uh, also, I struggle with some water retention edema, especially in my legs. Now, we just talked about that, didn't we, men? So, what we're saying here, kidneys, kidneys and adrenals, you get those adrenals up there, you got your epinephrine and norepinephrine, you got your endurance, you also are getting the kidneys cleaned up so you don't hold water, and, uh, and you won't lose your knees and your hips, man, because if you're not careful, as your kidneys keep failing, you'll lose your knees and your hip and no more soccer. So you really want to uh, get your kidneys fixed up and move that lymph system and get your adrenals online. And as you get into these higher levels, you'll kick butt there, my friend. So um, keep going with that. And, uh, and use some herbs. Absolutely use the herbs. Have fun with herbs. I don't care where you get them, have fun with them. But you want specifically for the kidneys, the adrenals, uh, unless you use a glandular, see what your blood pressure is, by the way. Check both arms for blood pressures. See where you are on that. And uh, in time, you're going to see low blood pressure with your diet and everything. But you might move through a, a phase, but the end phase uh, for a soccer player on fruitarian or a raw food lifestyle is nothing but incredible. A bandit 2888. If one is very interested in learning about producing herbal tinctures and capsules, how does one go about saying, I'd buy some very good herb books. And uh, I, I had to find some companies that where you buy the ones you don't buy in bookstores. These are the textbook type and uh, help you with that. There's a, um, what's her name? Um, oh, she's got a good uh, herbal course that you can, uh, Ma uh, Mary Gladstar. She's got a good herbal course. Uh, What's his name? East West has a good uh, Michael Terra. He's got an herb course, but I, the uh, Mary Gladstar shows you how to make them and stuff like that. So she's got a good herbal uh, coursework that you can take. Not really expensive, really good herbal course. I have it. I never finished her work, but good work. I like Mary Gladstar. She had a tremendous face cream out there. Just great stuff. I really like Mary Gladstar's face cream. We sell it here. Uh, but uh, uh, yeah, learn through the books how to do it. I, I know a little, but I'm a clinical person, so I really haven't had a lot of experience in making them and stuff. I've done some, but I, you know, I, that's not my expertise. My expertise is to know the herb, what the herb is can be used for, and how I can make these formulas and and the and and percentages and stuff like that. That's more my expertise. So you can't can't know it all. I mean, I. If you're in clinical practice, you don't have time to be a farmer, too. That's the problem. Everybody, and you, you don't want that. You want everybody to have their own part in creation. I need farmers. I need growers. I need all these different people. Uh, one, I, I'm one of those guys that can do a little of everything and uh, not a lot, of, but just a few things. But uh, sometimes you wear out trying to do everything. Eight minutes, and she'll be calling on the phone. Eight hour. minutes? Eight I thought minutes. I told you quarter after for her. Well, because you've got two coming in now, two half hours. Oh, but I'm not going to give her a half hour. I'm not going to give what's her name a half hour. I give her, a, okay. constantly give her a half hour. They're not two half hours coming in. No, I'm not going to do it. You see how they order me around here? I mean, eight minutes. Darn. Ah. Now, what's your take uh, regarding edema and hydration? Exactly. It's funny how we, this kind of goes. This is superhuman. This, see how these questions are interesting. See how they're all kind of going into that? So I guess that's the word of the day is uh, edema and, and water retention. And just use the word acidosis and kidney failure. <laughs> acidosis and kidney failure. They both go together. Uh, they're linked to the giant lymphatic system. They're linked also to the, the adrenal glands on top of the kidneys. And so... This whole program that we're talking about, this whole process of detoxification is how you rectify that problem.
because that problem uh, represents a much deeper issue of a lack of filtration of the acids that are created by the cells and the lack of the kidneys to filter these acids out of the bodies. Uh, generally speaking, the adrenal glands are probably the key factor in that problem. And, um, you know, one has to go after that. The bowels and stuff, get these acids out of the tissues. You won't hold water, your ankles won't swell, and the energy and endurance will go way up. And so as you're getting more activity and creating more lactic acid and all the other acids and activity, you're going to be able to get rid of them. And everybody's good. The body never gets sore or stiff or tight. And you have plenty of flexibility. You don't lose your joints. You don't have pain. No fibromyalgia, no lupus, none of that kind of crap, no cancer, nothing like that. This is the true doorway. That's why I always said the golden key is detoxification to the door of Wellville, health and vitality, and the light of God, you know. Uh, now that we have health in our own hands, is there any need to have health insurance? You know, it has gotten so out of control, I, I, I don't know how anybody can afford it. It's always good to have... Uh, uh, catastrophic type of insurance maybe uh, your car insurance covers most accidents and stuff anyway but it's just out of control the average person can't even begin to afford it I, I don't know what's going on with this Obamacare and why why he would be thinking people can afford stuff like this he's out of touch with with the, the humans if this Supreme Court says this is constitutional then we need a huge a huge stand up by all the citizens strap on your whatever you got at home uh, and let's go because you cannot have a government you talk about dictatorship that's right now that's right there it's a dictatorship by a corporation and the American federal government is a corporation they decided to create a corporation out this is not a constitutional government we have in place and so very serious ramifications to the, the humans in, 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 in the 50 states if this government thinks they can tell you when, where, and how to buy anything. This is serious, serious business right here, and this guy should have been impeached right now for even pushing that. He should have been kicked out of office right there. So there's somebody behind him. Could be a reptilian by now, who knows. <laughs> Here's that old man. Glad you mentioned about the cheat. I did this after years. I got five minutes. The okay, Rollison. but she's going to be calling, so you don't have time to write down your stuff. I am going to write it down, so she'll have to call back. No, we're not having her call back. What no. a... Oh, yeah, you got uh, butt kicking on wheat muffins. Now I know I got to run. So, <laughs> you see how they rule me here. But uh, they do have to keep me straight. All right, you all. Uh... I love you all, and thanks a lot. I'll try to get back with you as soon as possible. Have a great day. Have fun with this, and keep on going down the line. Thank you very much. Thank you.